My daughter had uh, a, a two accidents, unfortunately. One in 1986, uh, TBI, went through the acute stage, uh, coma for about 10 days, and then came out of the acute stage and needed rehab. So we heard about SHOP, and it was one of the top TBI rehab facilities in the West Coast. Renee was my little sister, and she was a, a, a tough kid. Uh, she was a, a, a kind of raised her the whole her whole life. She was like a daughter. Renee uh, uh, had an accident in 1985. It was uh, uh, comatose for three months. After I think another month or so, uh, she woke up, and so they brought her into Sharp uh, Rehabilitation Center. It just just starting out and they were teaching her how to talk and walk and little basic things like that. So when Ali got here, I went to the office, uh, the Sharp office, and I asked, does this happen often to, to kids? There's nobody pays for them. I said, well, I, I wanna help. Uh, I, wanna, I wanna put together a foundation to help. So interesting enough, someone else is doing that. So that somebody else was uh, Ray Willenberg, the Willenberg family. And Ray and I got together and we said, hey, we, we want to help the same people. We both had the same kind of values. We, you know, I raised motorcycles, he raised cars. And uh, so we kind of fit uh, together and uh, tapped all of our friends and family in. So uh, we've been <clears throat> chasing them for 38 years. I don't think they're getting tired of it yet though. <laughs> Uh, where there's no funds available or no insurance, SRF pays the, uh, the funding for that with SHARP. And we helped almost a thousand people to get back into society and get back into doing something. So you take a tragedy like that and you turn it into something good. Uh, and Ray and I have been able to do that, him with his sister and me for my daughter. So we've put hundreds and hundreds of uh, families that have survivors in the family of traumatic brain injury through the program here.